going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to a new video guys this is a really fun mod for today i'm really excited to to be putting this mod on my car i've been wanting to make my car look more aggressive in like cheaper ways so this is a 50 dollar mod that i decided to do i thought it would change the whole rear end of the car so like the rear bumper what it is let me go ahead and grab it i ended up getting some bumper extensions so kind of like canards but not really canards i don't really know what it's called exactly but it's for the rear bumper you put it underneath the rear bumper on both sides so i figured i might as well install these 50 bucks i got it from mashimaro from like instagram so i'll probably leave a link down there below it's not sponsored anything i bought this outright because i wanted to change the look of the rear end so go ahead and open this up see what exactly comes with the package so they're actually supposed to be carbon fiber. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, so they're supposed to be carbon fiber, but it only came with the plastic pieces. It didn't come with any of like the hardware to actually put it on, but realistically, it doesn't look that hard. I probably have some screws lying around. So if you are gonna get this kit, make sure you find some screws and some washers to, to actually put this on because these are actually pretty decently big like holes to like have to like screw into. So you're gonna need a washer for sure. It looks pretty self-explanatory though. Pretty much, I guess you're just gonna have to line it up on the bumper and then screw screw it on but let's go ahead go outside of the car check out what they would look like and then maybe we'll go do a photo shoot afterwards to show off the uh, actual like extensions okay so I guess it's supposed to be like this and then you kind of line it up how you would want it so I would probably want it like pretty flush with like the back so yeah just like that because if you do it right there well is that good is it good on that side or is it good on the far back because I'm not exactly sure uh, what I should do for this so let me see what it looked like on the picture so on the picture it had it lined up um, hmm that's hard to tell it's hard to tell okay let me go see some more pictures because it's hard to tell if it's on the back side or the front side it's really hard to see it so let me go look at some more pictures real quick all right so I think what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna go ahead I don't know should I do it from the front like that like, how does that look or should I do it back here that's the real question. I'm gonna do it from the front. I'm gonna do it from the front first, and if I like it, then I'll keep it. So let's go ahead and try that right now. Wow, okay, that looks really, really good, but it was a real pain to do, so what I ended up having to do, I had to drill into the bumper with like a specific drill, like an actual drill instead of the impact, because it just wasn't working with the impact. So I went ahead, drilled the holes down here, and then what I did is I took like some uh, screws with a washer on them, and I just screwed them up. So it's being held down pretty good. I don't want to crack it. Um, as you guys can see, you can see a little bit. Uh, in between but it is held in place pretty sturdily so I'm not too worried about that and I also use 3m to like hold it right here and I tried to do the 3m on that side but it didn't really work regardless it looks pretty good so especially from like this angle like it definitely is more aggressive like it looks really good we're gonna have to definitely do the other side and then drive it outside and see what it looks like so let's go ahead do this other side real quick All right guys, so we got this side on too. So far I'm really happy with it. I wanna go ahead and take it out into the sun, but uh, it's really harsh lighting right now. So I think we're gonna cut back in a little bit and go ahead and do a photo shoot, drive somewhere, do a photo shoot, show it off in better lighting. All right guys, so we're kinda like in the middle of nowhere right now. Um, we're just gonna be taking pictures. I haven't ever been out this way, so kinda like straight up in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Go ahead and drive around a little bit so you guys can hear the car. I'm kind of just like straight up in the middle of nowhere. I don't even know where I am. I just kind of started driving.
so you guys can like see what they look like on the car but the lighting is still too harsh in the sunlight and not good enough in the shade just yet so I'm kind of waiting for golden hour which is like realistically in about 45 minutes um, I've already been out for like 45 minutes so I, I kind of wanted to get an early start try to find some cool spots to, to shoot at Right, guys i figured we should just go for a drive real quick i i really want to show off the uh the fins but there's just like the lighting is just really bad still so i guess i'll just drive around for a little bit Okay, so I guess this is like the river over here. I'm not sure which river it is, but you can kind of see the uh, the fins right over here, what they look like. Definitely makes the car way more aggressive. Hopefully you guys can see it like this. This is actually a really cool spot. I actually like this drive. This is the first time I've ever been out here. Um, maybe you guys can see that right there though. Makes it way more wide, um, especially if, like from the back. It just, it's hard to like, yeah, like right over here maybe. I oh, don't know, let me grab my camera real quick though because this is pretty sick. There's a car coming though, so we should probably get going. So this is a pretty cool spot. I kind of like this spot right here. Oh, I think this would be sick. I actually want to do this real quick. Whoa, this is sketchy. I think this spot's kind of cool. Oh yeah, this is sick. cool though kind of just like nobody out here Alright guys, so we are out in the middle of nowhere pretty much. I've been taking pictures. I want to focus. Focus on me. There we go. So I've been taking a bunch of pictures of the fins and everything and uh, got a cool video. So I'm going to hopefully edit that video. Hopefully it's going to be in here. Um, try to do a cinematic video. But let me go ahead and show you guys why I still have a little bit of daylight. This is what they look like. Let me close the door. So pretty much this is what they look like on the car. Now they are black so it's kind of hard to see. But like right over there, it definitely does add like... A bit of girthiness and like right here like you can definitely tell that's more aggressive it's it looks better in person and probably in like better lighting this is actually pretty good lighting but in other lighting with like lights bouncing off of it like in the city it would look really really good I think next up is definitely gonna have to be some wheels I already got a suspension kit I just I don't know how to install it so I'm waiting on that for some help from some friends hopefully so uh, here it is 
it's coming together so now we got the lip we got the wrap obviously um, now we got these down here these fins down here we also have the spoiler the exhaust the catless downpipe the tune hopefully you guys enjoy these types of videos with like the mods I have a lot of fun like making them and driving the car around and it's, it's coming together slowly the process it's a lot of money so taking it slowly I think I definitely need some wheels. The wheels are just throwing it off now at this point. Everything else looks good. I just need some better wheels. So I guess I'll end it right here. So hopefully you guys like this video. I'll go ahead and leave the links down below. So if you guys want to cop one of these uh, sets of like these extensions, fin extensions or whatever they're called. I don't, it, there's so many different names for them like canards, but they're not really canards. I don't know. I'll leave the link down below if you guys want to cop it. Remember guys, follow me on Instagram. I'll go ahead and throw it right over here. Uh, it really helps me out if you guys follow me on Instagram and subscribe as well. Definitely subscribe down below guys if you like the videos I make. It definitely helps me a ton to make more videos for you guys. Make sure to like the video. It really helps me out as well. So remember to stay safe, stay happy, and stay in that project car. I will catch you guys later.